are at the show. Yes, I can't believe we finally made it. Nice. <laughs> We're at the Bow Revival. And look, look at the little parachuters. Is it a sand down? Dillard's today. I don't know why, but apparently there's some Christmas stuff there that she said is pretty cool. Y'all, it is not even October 31st, and my husband wants to put the Christmas tree up for two weeks now, at least. So it makes Minimum him super happy. Love Christmas. If we just go look at Christmas, it puts him in a good mood, it puts me in a good mood. So we're gonna go look at all the Christmas at Dillard's and we're gonna take you with us. Keeping people, please. This is my favorite holiday It's a chance to start over new Cause I missed you so I'm letting go of everything but you Oh, I like that Yeah, this is a good one How it's supposed to be Making our Christmas memories, oh Santa, look at Santa's workshop. They want a hundred and nine dollars for Santa's workshop. I know it's so good. Look at the gingerbread house, I love it. Joyous time of the year. I love it. 
So Kevin and I had so much fun looking at all the Christmas decorations, but this is the next morning. I just got finished working out in our garage gym and the kitties always wait for me at the back door because as soon as I come in, it's time for treats. with our makeup. So I use this CoverGirl Olay, Simply Ageless. And I do have this In Beauty. It's a face glaze. And I like to just um, mix this in with my foundation. Just kind of gives the face a little glow. And I use my Beauty Blender. show tonight the Michael Carbonaro you know, ever watch that show on TV it's the Carbonaro effect I think it's so good and um, it's at the Beau Rivage Casino in Biloxi it's about a two-hour drive from us so um, my son my husband and I are gonna go see the show so that's what we're getting ready for Okay, now I'm just taking these two different e.l.f. concealers. One's a little darker. Let's see. Uh, I'm not going to be able to read the... Yeah, I, I don't know what color this is. This one's just a little lighter, but they're both by e.l.f. One's a little lighter, one's a little darker. And I just put a couple of dots under my eye, and then I use the lighter one, too. And use the beauty blender to blend it out. Great drugstore concealer. I also use this on the little dark spots that I don't like down here. Any sunspots, old acne scars. Let's look at that on. I am going to set with a little powder. I just use this Milani foundation powder, I think is what it's called. Let's see. Conceal Perfect. And I'm in Natural Light 03. Brush the eyebrows up a little bit. I never have plucked my eyebrows or colored them or really done anything with them. Too scared. Anyway, next we're gonna go in with a little hula bronzer.
stickers and um, I couldn't tell you what color. <laughs> Wait, deep plum. I saw it. Okay. Deep plum. I love a good blush. I just use the same brush for blush and bronzer. And I do like a little highlight. So I use this little brush, and this is a, what is this, Wet n Wild Hello Halo. It's broken, but it still works really good. And just take a little bit of this, go right under the eye, just to create a little sparkle and shine. makeup tricks and tips and then just use your fingers to blend it out <laughs> also um, if you want to go back in with that little light color after you get that darkest color on and do a little brow bone highlight hug tight to the lash line. Now they say the older you get, you're not supposed to line your bottom. I really like to line the bottom. So I just do a little bit. Just a little. I feel like it wakes my eyes up. I know everybody says no, it makes you look older. No, I don't know. It makes me feel like awake yet if I don't have just a little bit liner on the bottom. Just a little. I go in with my mascara. This is, um, can you see it? I need some glasses. Can't get them on because of my... It's waterproof mascara. Crazy volume. Oh, by Essence. Supposed to do the bottom lashes either, but guess what? I already messed up with the eyeliner, so we're just barely sweeping the bottom lashes. You don't want them to look like spiders down there, but brush these brows up again just a little bit. All right, I put a little lip liner on these lips. Just so that line doesn't look so harsh. I always feel like the lip liner helps my lipstick to stay on all day. It's by Milk. It's a lipstick and like a cheek tint, but I like it for lipstick. Mm. I guess it would be nice to tell you the color of it. But again, we might need those glasses for Mm -mm. I don't think we're gonna be able to see this. Yeah. I'm sorry, but it's this. And I also like to put a little bit of gloss on top. This is by that same company in Beauty, and it's just called Glaze. I really like this stuff. It's very juicy and glossy. Mm. We love a good glossy lip makeup setting spray. It is called All Nighter by Urban Decay. Do that and let it dry.
fingers through the bottom. Okay, and when you like it, spray it. Okay. It's not too bad. We'll go ahead and spray this. Man. Come check it out. The kitties all set up. They are ready. We're just spending one night in Biloxi, so this should hold them over. Airbnb. We are here. We're going to chill for a little while, maybe lay out by the pool, and uh, then we'll get ready for the show and we'll take you with us. Do you have a good picture of both chairs empty or is that in the way for you? You can see it with that in the way and everything. Both chairs are empty. Good. I might call on you to look at your phone during the trick. Good. Then we're going to reverse the process. I'm going to take the cloth and I'm going to start over here and I'm going to cover up Rocco. What's Rocco can no longer see? Quick, quick, like a little bunny. You're going to come running out here. Austin, Austin, yes, quick, like a quiet little bunny. Good. Act. One, two, three. One, two, three. And that's how a game is played. You ready to give this a shot? There you go. Well, let's welcome Rocco back in the room, everybody. Uh, sorry, I went on a little tangent there. How to speak to you. But that's, that's actually the first time that I believe. <laughs> such a great time at the magic show. We all really enjoyed it. It was so entertaining. But it's the next morning and Kevin and I are taking a little walk while our teenager sleeps in and before we have to get back on the road.
all the houses in this area were all demolished back when Hurricane Katrina came in 2005 and they have all been rebuilt now and they are just beautiful. It's one of our favorite things to do is come and look at all the beautiful houses. Coming up, this is my favorite house on the street. I just love the color and the style. And my favorite is the swimming pool. Look at this beautiful pool. I just love it. But anyway, I hope y'all really enjoyed this video. I had a great time these last couple of days and I hope you enjoyed it. Be sure and give it a like and subscribe on your way out. You're gonna do it, Jenny. Go for it. Do 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 Also gonna make one other keto dish and it's a KFC mock chicken bowl and I will show you what goes into that. Okay, it's gravy time. Now look, this does not get super thick. Okay, it's real thin, but so flavorful. So I'm just drizzling on top.